Hello, everybody. For those of you that were unable to make it to class today, I'm just going to run through what the homework is so you are better prepared to know what to do over the weekend. So, pull this open for you. So the homework assignment is an art recreation assignment. And so what I want you to do is I want you to take a famous piece of art that you like and then recreate it on your own using um, just whatever you have around you and then take a picture of that recreation. And I'll show you some pictures. So like up top, you can see these are the works of art and on the bottom, these are the recreations. So like if you, you want to get into a pose and try and match one of the art pieces, something like that would be fine. Or like here, you see she's in the same outfit. They're trying to match the angle with the window and the light coming in. Here's some more. These are, you know, tape the bucket to the head to match this picture. We've got the different portraits who we're trying to match. This one's a little more abstract, but they're matching the, the spotted horse to the uh, clothing there with the spots. Here's another example, famous modern art piece, and they've done it on their toast. Here's another famous painting, or this one, just a tray of food, and then they've got their kind of modern rendition. I'm also fine, like on this, you see the Legos rendition of Nighthawks, and there's the painting itself. If you want to do something like this, rather than take a picture of yourself or someone else, if you want to make a model uh, or out of Legos, that's fine. I had some, some students ask me if they could do it in Fortnite, and I am okay with that. If you make recreate an art piece in Fortnite and then have a screenshot of it. Or you could do it with Legos or Minecraft or something like that. So what I need you to do is to pick a famous work of art to recreate, take a picture of your recreation and make sure you have the right angle and the right, you know, like the lighting to kind of match the work of art and then have it ready to screen share to the class by this coming Wednesday. And that'll be what we'll do that class is we'll share with each other the different things that we've done. And there have been a couple of students that have already finished. So let me pull that up for you as well so you can see their work as an example. So let me move you this. So as you can see here, Carter was trying to recreate this Van Gogh self-portrait. And he did a pretty fun rendition of that. He even has the beard. So job well done. So that's kind of an example of what you could do. So you take a work of art and then you come up with your own rendition. So not too hard and it should be pretty fun. I want you guys to have fun with this. Uh, another tool that is available to you is an app you can get that's made by Google that's called Google Arts and Culture. And let's let me join this. Hold on one second. Okay. So this is the app up here, Google Arts and Culture. You can get it in the Play Store. And this app might be helpful to you if you're trying to find a thing to do because A, it, it's full of art that you can explore, a bunch of different kinds of art, which is fun. But as you can see on the bottom of the screen, it also has this camera feature. And so you can actually take the second option, take an art selfie. And it will match what your face shape is and everything. Oh, man, it's embarrassing. With a work of art. So it's saying that I look like uh, this picture. 
and that picture. So it, so, but that, that's an option too. You can take a picture of yourself and you can say, okay, I wanna recreate this portrait or whatever. And if you have any questions, you can always reach out to me. But I want you to just pick something that you'd have fun doing and it doesn't need to be anything too complicated, but have fun with it. And then on Friday, or on, not on Friday, on Wednesday, we'll do, we'll share what we have done in a screen share. So that way the other members of the class can see that. And then I'll have you just email me the, the picture that you picked and then the one that you took of yourself or of the scene that you picked. And that will be it. So if you have any questions, feel free to send me an email or post an LMS. The email is easier because I get that directly and I check it more often than LMS, but either way, I will get back to you to help you out. So I hope you have a wonderful day and you were missed in class, those of you that weren't here.